having a shower while enjoying a lovely beverage from a minor place cafe in Brunswick. cutting to little flowerettes, etc. So we're just gonna bang that in the bowl there, lovely. So in this little spice mix here, it's kind of like a Middle Eastern type spice mix. I just wanna get on camera. And um, <laughs> what I've got in there, I've got about half a teaspoon of ground coriander, half a teaspoon of ground cumin, um, quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon, quarter of a teaspoon of nutmeg, and a quarter of a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. So it's gonna be quite spicy, it's nice, I like spice. So, we'll just sprinkle that over there. A little bit of seasoning, just a pinch of sea salt, or pink sea salt, Himalayan salt, and a pinch of black pepper. Lovely, so I'll give that a toss around. Okay, so what I have here is uh, about two tablespoons of uh, coconut oil that I've just melted slightly. We're gonna use half of that, so I just use half of that over the cauliflower. Beautiful. Give it a little toss. Give it a stir. Get all those spices around now. So we're going to just put that in the um, in this pan, a nice cast iron pan. Going straight in to our oven, it's about 165, 166. You know, 166 and a half if you have to. That's Celsius. Yes, yes it is. And it's going to go on the top tray there. And they are going to cook for about 30 minutes. I want them nice and roasted. And after about 20 minutes, I'm going to put some walnuts in there just to toast them off as well. Stop, 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 stop. No, this is good. This is, good. This is magic. This is magic. Just got one little bit of kale right here. So I'm going to do that. I'm just going to take it off the stem with a little knife here. Let's just cut that off the stem there. Quite a big knife, Jules. Not yeah. Really, not really a little knife. Yeah, it's even bigger. <laughs> we don't need that, so I'm just cut that off. <laughs> We're gonna clean that up later. We want pieces about that big. We're gonna roast them and make some kale chips for our salad. So we just wanna, you got little bits like that, just chuck them on there. When you got a little bigger bits like that, just tear them up. You only want them about that size, yeah? Oh, nom 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 nom. Nom 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 kale. <laughs> anyway, so now that we've um, turned all these, this big bit of kale into little bits of kale, what we're gonna do is we've got the other tablespoon of uh, coconut oil there. So I'm just going to drizzle, I'm just going to drizzle that over the top. Just try and coat all the leaves. I'm just going to season that. Just a little pinch of salt and pepper to bring out the natural flavours. And this is also going into the oven at about 165, 166 and a half maybe. And that, that will actually take about 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, we'll turn them and they should be perfect. So, while we wait for those, the cauliflower and the kale to roast, or bake, whatever you want to call it, I'm just going to make a simple little dressing. Like, you don't want, because there's so many spices on the cauliflower, it's quite tasty already. You don't really want uh, overpowering dressing. You just want something light and just something to bring it all together, really. So, what I've got here is half a tablespoon of Dijon mustard. I've got the juice of half a lemon, so I'm just going to squeeze that in there. Give that a little mix together. And what I've got here is about a quarter of a cup of uh, light olive oil. So I don't, I don't want anything too overpowering. I want the cauliflower and the kale to really come through and really, um, really be the main players in this dish. So I'm just going to whisk that in there, just with a fork. I'm going to put a little pinch of salt, sea salt in there, a little pinch of pepper. Give a little whisk. Have a little taste. That'll do nicely. Actually done. Ten minutes done. I think I had the oven a bit hot, but that's fine. Uh, perfect. Kale chips. Isn't it? Isn't it? 
<laughs> Delicious. So, 10 minutes in the cow chips, we've learned something today. Okay. So, just grab the cauliflower a little bit. We'll just give that a bit of a toss. This is going to need a fair bit longer. Maybe another 15 minutes, so 25 minutes all up. After, say, 10 minutes, I'm going to chuck the walnuts in there so they can toast up as well. See, they're almost there. I'll give them five more minutes and they'll be perfect. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them just some crushed walnuts. I've got about, I won't need that much. Probably if you use like maybe an eighth of a cup or something like that, that'll be perfect. I'm just going to sprinkle them around. They'll just get nice and toasty in there, bring out those um, nice toasted nutty flavours. Okay, so they get back in there for five minutes. Come here. So, about five minutes ago, I took the cauliflower and the walnuts out of the oven, so they've just cooled down just a little bit. You don't want it too hot down in the salad, just nice sort of lukewarm sort of temperature. Okay, and over here, I've just roughly chopped up a quarter of a bunch of parsley and a quarter of a bunch of coriander. They're just together there. Okay, so let's put this salad together. So I have a big ass bowl here. I have a big bowl here. <laughs> Where the um, cauliflower and the walnuts can go in there, lovely. That pan a bit hot in my hand, excellent. I'm gonna put the parsley and coriander. Smells so good. Mm-hmm. You might do you taste it. I have my dressing here, I'm just gonna give it a little bit of a stir up and just drizzle that over there. So I obviously made too much dressing, you don't need that much dressing. I've got about maybe three and a half tablespoons in there. So I'm just gonna give that a little bit of a stir. And you probably notice I haven't put the kale in there with the cauliflower. Of course, it's quite crispy. And I don't want to break it all up into little pieces. I'm just going to place it on there real delicately. is there, nice flavours. And that there is my roast cauliflower and kale salad. Well, I'm just gonna eat this as I'm saying because I think it's delicious. But I think that would be perfect with just a lamb filler or something like that. But today, just a salad. What's going on? What are you doing? I'm just having a shower while enjoying a delicious <laughs> beverage from a minor place. <laughs> <laughs> 